information is still unfolding over the circumstances of the event. As you mentioned, most likely this is a potential uh, precision Israeli airstrike on uh, Beirut's uh, southern suburb of uh, Dahi, which is uh, Hezbollah uh, stronghold, uh, as well as a stronghold that hosts a number of uh, the same militia groups and their leaders and offices as well. What we know so far is that uh, there, uh, the second uh, floor on, uh, of one of the buildings uh, in uh, Beirut's southern suburb of Dahi was targeted. It is most likely it was targeted with an Israeli uh, airstrike, potentially a drone uh, airstrike, according to preliminary information. Uh, sources uh, close to Hezbollah, in particular their uh, affiliated media, have confirmed that among those who have been uh, targeted is uh, Hamas senior uh, official Saleh al arui uh, Now, if we want to uh, discuss who is uh, Saleh al arui in particular, he is uh, one of the most senior members uh, of uh, Hamas. He is also one of one of the founding members of Hamas's military wing, which is the Qassam uh, Brigade. Uh, he was uh, basically uh, basically uh, put by uh, the U.S. Uh, also on their terrorist list since 2015. So we're talking about a very uh, precision and targeted airstrike that targeted a very senior uh, figure. Uh, we've seen Israeli media before and Israeli officials who have uh, said that uh, uh, Qassam Brigade uh, leaders and Hamas leaders all over the world are uh, potentially subject uh, to uh, assassinations by uh, the Israeli army and intelligence. And it appears that this is the first one happening outside of uh, Gaza and uh, the West Bank since October 7th. Andrew, this uh, attack is 